Hey guys, coming at you today with my last and final most important tip in this series I've been doing. Um, I've really had a lot of fun with this. Uh, this, If you don't know me, I'm Teal from TealYielding.com and we have been talking about stepping off the struggle bus. I know I ride the struggle bus so much <laughs> and there are little things um, that I have found that kind of have kind of helped me feel like less of a hot mess and I've had fun like sharing these with all of you and so I saved my most important tip for last and I want to talk about it today and that is the importance of tapping into a support network. Um, for me that was hard for me especially you know knowing you know I I was the type of person that didn't think I needed support, um, especially when it came to trying to connect with other, you know, women and moms. And I didn't, I just didn't think I was somebody who needed that. But it ended up helping me so much. So the reason this was so key for me is, first of all, it helps you to realize that you're not alone. Um, we talked a little bit about that comparison trap that we can kind of fall into. Everybody is struggling with something. Everybody is on a journey. They're wanting to achieve something. Um, and you're not the only one that feels like a hot mess. So it really is important for you to just realize, you know, you're not alone. There are other people out there struggling like you. And when you band together, it's it's pretty powerful. So ways to, to, to look for support networks and... It, and people who are going through what you're going through. I would say not only look through people, look for people who are in your stage of life. Maybe you have kids the same age. Maybe your kids go to the same school. Maybe you, um, you know, have similar hobbies or something. But not just that you are in the similar stage of life, but that you look for people who have similar goals. So it's not just that you have these things in common, but it's that you're wanting to go somewhere with it. That you're wanting to achieve something. Maybe all you're trying to achieve is just positivity and let's survive the school year together or uh, the softball season or whatever it is. Um, it doesn't have to be some big mega huge goal, but you are moving in a direction. So you're either moving in a positive direction or a negative direction. So look for people who want to move in a positive direction and achieve something so you can kind of achieve it together. There um, is such huge power in accountability and uh, just having somebody there to be a listening ear and you can kind of, you know, share what your struggles are and, you know, work through it together. Um, for me, one of the things that I always really struggled with um, was more health related um, when, when it came to nutrition. I am uh, a self-proclaimed uh junk food junkie. I, I don't always make the best decisions when it came to staying on track with my nutrition. Um, but, you know, I worked out a lot, but that the nutrition was the part that was hard for me. So I um, found a group of ladies that were on a similar journey and we kind of banded together and we have a little group where we show up daily and uh, cheer each other on and, you know, not only cheer on the successes, but kind of work through the setbacks um, and realize that nobody is perfect. But I know there's that little extra push for me because I know that they're expecting me to show up every day. So not only is it benefiting myself, but I feel like I can kind of help them as well. Um, so we just kind of use the power of accountability there. So that's huge. Um, the last thing is to just use your village. Um, you know, they say it takes a village, but in, unless you tap into that and use it, then it's not going to help you. So ask for help. You know, there are people that have been through what you're going through most likely. Sorry, my dog's getting impatient. <laughs> They've been through what you're going through, but you may never know what advice they have to offer if you don't ask for help and ask for advice. And, you know, don't look at the world like you feel like everybody's judging you, but, you know, genuinely ask for help when you need it. So use that village. Um, and all of these things are going to be things that can help you step off that struggle bus. And that's why I've saved this for last because I feel like support is the most important thing. I call it the secret sauce um, to making you feel a little bit like, a little bit less like a hot mess, a little bit more put together. So I've had so much fun doing this for you guys. Um, I'm hoping to get some more stuff out for you and uh, stay tuned.